Now that our two additional buttons for search are created, that is the YouTube and the Amazon buttons, these are radio buttons, we have to add them to the functions get and callback in order to respond, in order to have them respond to the search functionality. So how do we do this? Well, let's start with the callback function over here. Um, the one this is the one that responds to clicking uh, the search button this one so we'll what we'll have to do is simply add two more elif statements so let's do the one for amazon first so okay so elif button to dot get equals equals so the value of amazon is amz then web browser open and it's going to be i have it written down http um, amazon dot com s question mark url equals search Elias percentage 3D strip books and field keywords that's it and whatever it's inside our entry get function so whenever we input text over here and hit the search and we have the Amazon radio button, it's going to search on Amazon for whatever is in our entry in this one in our entry field. Um, okay, and the other one, the one for um, the one for YouTube elif button to get equals equals the value of the button YouTube is YTB. Okay, then web browser open. And this is simpler HTTPS. This is also HTTPS. Okay, so HTTPS. Um, it's going to be youtube.com results question mark search query and whatever it's inside our entry field entry one dot get okay Hopefully I have this right. And let's just another, let's just add another else pass over here. Okay, so we're gonna do the same thing for the um, get function, which is basically the one that's called back when you search for something and hit enter instead of clicking the search button. So we'll do the same thing copy these paste them over here make sure they are indented correctly okay now let's see if we get an error here so let's save and run it f5 okay all right, so we have no error. Now let's test this by searching for one of my books on Amazon. So select Amazon and let's search for stress and adaptation, adaptation, stress and adaptation. Click on the search. Okay, let's do the same thing by instead of clicking the search, we'll hit the enter 
So stress and adaptation and I'm hitting the enter button. And it does the same thing. All right, um, I guess this is it for this video. And the next one will probably start on working on this voice search functionality. Okay, so if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.